At Momofuku Milk Bar, David Chang and Christina Tozzi's mini chain of bakeries, in the month of November, you can pick up an entire Thanksgiving meal, all in a single croissant. Their Thanksgiving croissant starts, of course, with a stuffing-flavored dough made by layering pastry with a compound butter filled with celery seed, thyme, and black pepper. The thin layer of solid butter is repeatedly rolled and folded. With each fold, the layers of pastry and butter increase exponentially, creating the croissant's signature flakiness. Pastry cook Zoe Kanan gives the dough a final roll on the countertop before cutting it into triangles and filling it. The croissant is then stuffed with roasted turkey that we brine overnight and stuff with garlic and lemons. We pick the dark meat and the light meat and make a wonderful mixture of the two. All of the fillings are frozen before being incorporated into the croissant like this cranberry sauce made with 200 pounds of cranberries flavored with rosemary and orange. Freezing the fillings ensures that they stay in place as the croissant is formed. Even the gravy sees some time in the freezer. It's made from the drippings of the roasted turkeys that get piped out into little fingers. Each of these solid gravy plugs is placed inside a croissant, ready to melt and bind all of the fillings together as they heat up in the oven. Don't you just love the idea of a gravy plug? Zoe rolls each pastry up into its familiar crescent shape, though like most things around Thanksgiving time, these croissants are a little bit fatter than usual. We started out with 28 turkeys. We thought that that was gonna last us, but then about halfway through, we had to do the whole process again. We can't keep them in the stores. It's nice because I think cranberry sauce, turkey, these are things you have exclusively on Thanksgiving when you eat the croissant that's filled with these delicious things outside of that setting, it's like a good experience. We had them last year for the first time and I definitely had more than my share then. This year, you know, we've kind of upped the ante a little and everything's a little more delicious. So I'm still munching. Happy, Happy Thanksgiving. Thanksgiving from all of us at Serious Eats.